Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel. My name is Molly Pretzel and I'm here to teach you beginner pole dancing. Today's video is all about leg hangs and in my opinion it's actually not a beginner move or beginner moves. For sure you're gonna try it at home anyway so I'd rather explain it in a safe and good and technically good manner so you're gonna try it in the right way instead of destroying yourself but in my opinion, make sure that you have a good and solid straddle before you do that or at least can invert proper. I'm going to show the move from the straddle in order to make it a little bit harder for you to try at home if you do not have your straddle yet. First leg hang we're going to try. Um, I actually don't know the name for it, but in Danish I call it undi, which means like pretty because I think it's a pretty shape. So, we're gonna do pretty. What we wanna do is our straddle, so make sure that you go in your right position, butt in front, in your squeezy part, elbow to the hip, hands down, squeeze your arms together. From here, you wanna tuck up into your front position. Now, you wanna pull upwards with your leg, grab with your knee, and then squeeze in the fat part of your leg to the pull. So you're hanging here, you're squeezing here, you're in your squeezy part. Now make sure to take your chest forward and then you can be here. I'm squeezing with this part of my arm. So right now I have three spots that I'm hanging into. Arm, fat part of my thigh and knee. To get down I'm going to slide in my hand in between and I'm going to take this leg up. I'm going to come down again slowly. So, your contact points here, here, and here. When you're in the position, make sure that your knee is proper locked. You might end up in a situation where the upper knee is kind of like this, and then it's not really locking. So make sure that when it goes here, you slide it down, slide your hands down, put the thigh in, squeeze, squeeze, chest forward and then you can look all pretty. I would recommend you to feel good in the pretty position before you attempt the two other leg hangs. Now for the next leg hang. This is one of the moves that you for sure are gonna use the most in your pole dance life because it's like the base of a billion tricks. So, it's similar to pretty. The leg, um, one of the legs is just a little bit different. This is called an outside leg hang. The reason for that is, when I'm standing next to the pole, it's going to be the leg furthest away from the pole that's going to hang. So this is my outside leg. I'm going to do the same as before. I'm going to be here. From here, I tuck in, and it's going to be this leg lifting. So I tuck in, now it's the same thing. This leg is going up, then I'm going to hook from here, I'm going to slide down my arms while I take my chest forward. I extend this leg backwards using my butt to pull down. If I'm squeezing enough with this arm, I can straighten it and then I'm going to straighten the other one. And now I'm in my outside leg hang. Again, very important, chest forward, this is going to make the whole difference. It's going to make it look prettier, you're going to stick better and you're not going to break your ribs. So there's no reason in that showing your boobs in pole dance or in life. Time for leg hang number three. This is called an inside leg hang because this inside leg, the one closest to the pole. This is very painful. The pain will go away at some point. What is going to happen is that you're going to do your straddle. I'm going to explain this before I do it. When I'm here and my leg comes up, I'm going to slide this hand away. It's a little bit hard to show on the camera and I have no cameraman to come and move it. So I hope it will make sense. This hand sliding to the side. So I'm here. I'm doing my straddle. Then I'm sliding, placing my fat part and locking. Taking this leg backwards. Now for the very important part. This leg stays very close. I'm going to roll to my back. Feeling the pull on my back, and I'm gonna hang here. Come, come down, 
slowly. So in this one, it's very important that you get to place your flat part of your thigh on the pole. Lock in as close as you can. Do never ever take your hand and do this. It's harmful to your knee. It's not good. So this, in, logging should happen with muscles. From here, make sure to open up sideways to fill the pole on your back. And this was leg hand number three. And the last one for the beginner pull down series. Don't feel too sad. You're gonna see me again. I'm gonna do a bunch of other beginner stuff like flow and choreography and whatever you write down in the comment. I'm also gonna do. So please give me a comment what you like about the series, what you dislike, what you want to see in the future. Remember to subscribe to my channel so you can see when I make the video you want me to make. And I will see you again soon. Bye.